Hello everyone and welcome back to Farm Three Houses. In this episode, we're gonna start things off by turning Hubert into a Dark Bishop at long, long last. There we go. Holy crud, this is gonna be fun. Ayo, and he gets a, a stat boost. What's it gonna be? Oh, oh, his defense is boosted up a bit. Nice. Yeah, we're gonna swap him into that class because I, no way, he hasn't sw finished up his normal Dark Mage. Uh, I want to double check what the max out on this is. I'm not sure. Oh, I don't... It doesn't even show it. Okay. But, uh, yeah, that's good. Burnan, Bernie. Uh, do I have any more advanced deals? Yes, I do. Six. So let's turn Bernie into a paladin. This will not help her speed at all, though. It's actually still going to be quite bad. But, hey, she's in a different class now. That's good. Oh, not bad, though. Her defense went up. That's really nice, actually. Uh, Dorothea, I don't want to do anything for her yet. Petra's already an assassin. I think the only characters who haven't been... The only one who hasn't gone into another class yet is Linhart. That's sadly it. Because Leonie's been a paladin for a while now. So anyway, let's go on to the main course for today's episode, which will be... Uh, let's do... Uh, yeah, let's do Falling Short of Heaven. Let's begin. This is where Pegasus Knight scared me. There you are. I have a request for you. Cool. A request? It has to do with that plot to assassinate Lady Rhea. The bishop leading the Western Church was somehow involved. And speaking of the Western Church, there was also that incident in which one of the more extreme factions tried to occupy sacred land. Enough is enough. So now the Knights of Saros have been tasked with putting the bishop down. I thought you and your students could come with us. Why for such an important mission? Because you wield the Sword of the Creator. Okay. Lady Rhea is going to personally execute the bishop. I have been appointed as her guard. I want your help protecting her. So, what do you say? Will you come? Um, excuse me. I'd like to come along. Ash, you were listening in? It's not up to you whether you can come along. Please, this is important to me. Your adoptive father, Lord Lonato, had connections to the Western Church. I understand that you want answers. But our objective is to punish, not to investigate. We can't let you jeopardize the mission. I won't get in the way. I promise. Hmm. What do you say, Professor? Keep in mind, we would be bringing the whole class, not just Ash. We'll go. Thank you so much. Okay, I guess it's fine. Get ready then. Oh boy, guys, get ready for this level. It's a defense mission where we have to defend Rhea, whose stats are kind of all right. You'd expect them to be a bit higher than what they are, but oh well. But yeah, this level is going to be very interesting because it's a fog of war map, which means we can't really see too far. And plus defense mission. On top of that, we also have to... I think we can move Catherine in this level. I am not sure, but Ash might be a little bit of a liability for this one. We'll we'll see what happens. So anyway, I'm just gonna do a couple of adjustments. Move Casper right there. Uh, Ferdinand over here. Uh, you know what? This should be fine. Oh wait, one last thing. I almost forgot. Linhart, we are giving you back your stinking stride. There we go. I don't know why I got that to Marianne. I don't know why I did, but oh well. Anyway, gonna save real quick, and let's begin. There she is. A sneaky little witch, trying to pass herself off as the goddess's envoy. Archbishop Rhea, I'll bring judgment upon you in the goddess's stead. They're using the fog as cover to ambush us. What a cheap ploy. It won't do any good to get annoyed, Catherine. That voice. We are up against a faction of bishops. They've shown themselves, at least. So we won't have to go to the trouble of finding them. All right. 
You got a death wish? Come at me! You really want to fight against Thunder, Catherine? Please, Professor, don't let Lady Rhea get hurt. Our mission isn't just to wipe out all the enemies, but also to protect Lady Rhea. Ready? Sure, Simp. Anyway, we need to protect Rhea for 10 turns. That or defeat the boss. So, let's begin by pay. throwing Edelgard all the way over here. Silver Axe, yeah, we'll keep that ready. That's my Because key. there are a bunch of Pegasus Knights that are going to be over here, and Edelgard is our best bet at taking them down. Stay focused. So now I'm going to move Byleth over here. Let's put an Iron Sword to be safe. Okay, so far so good. Ferdinand, okay, there we go. There's a mage. I will get the victory. So let's have Petra go ahead and... You know what, Killing Edge? <laughs> Dang it, no crit. Ow. All right, not bad, though. Bridget Pride. Doing good. And we got a torch. You know what? We're going to get rid of the iron sword to keep that. And now let's have Linhart go here. Yeah, we're just going to use a basic heal. Nice. Let's get to Next up. Uh, this next bit's going to be rough. Okay, and I can use Catherine. Good. Uh, Put me in there. Let's put Caspar just a little bit down here just to see. Okay. I'll give it Not much to worry about right now. Gonna move Ash right there. Have uh Dorothea go down here a little bit. Have Leone as well. Okay, nothing yet. That's good. Hubert can probably stay where he is. We need someone to help defend Rhea. Anyway, here comes the Peg Knights, and I was correct. Edelgard is the best bet against them right now. Okay, another mage. That's gonna hurt. And another mage. That also hurt a little bit, but we're fine. I'm going to see other units are moving, because this map is actually pretty huge. And Caspar goes in. He's actually doubling now! Finally! One took him ages. Nice. All right, well done, Caspar. Now we got nine more turns remaining, so... Oh, uh, let's see. I don't really have Linhart do anything, so... At least can't do any damage, anyway. Fernand doesn't double, but he does one-shot with a Silver Lance, which is good. The well done, Ferdy. Uh, let's have him move a little bit further up here. Nice. Now Petra can go ahead and take care of... This guy. <laughs> nice, she dodged. Awesome. Flame spirit and she leveled up as well. Very nice, Petra. Good level. Mm, my girl. Okay. She is now rocking. That is good. All right, heal up Ferdinand to be safe. And now... Okay, I forgot I, have, I had Bernie on Leone, so I kind of want to try and level up a little bit. And I forgot. I put someone with Ash. Yeah, I put Ingrid. All right, let's move Ash a little bit over here just in the event where Edelgard can't finish off any of them. And speaking of which, let's move Caspo. Okay. Not good. Not good at all, Dorothea. Yeah, thank you. Oh, crud. Edelgard's still in... Not in Edelgard, sorry. Rhea's still in danger. Okay, Hubert, time to tank. You know, you're not the greatest at that, but we'll see what happens. Oh, is there no one over here? Crud. Oh, there are. Yeah. Oh, there is. Okay, nice job, Byleth. Like that. There were multiple assassins. Really? An 82? You missed an 8? Well, that's a shift in targets. A weird shift in targets. I think you would have done more damage to Hubert, but... I guess not. I don't know. Now they're all targeting Caspar, which I don't mind. Right makes might. Now that's just making me wish I put Ingrid with Caspar instead, but oh well. Alright, so Ash over here. Move Edelgard up. Doesn't look like there's anyone over there yet, but I could be wrong. Let's heal up. Alright, where the crud are you guys? Nope, nothing over there. I just remembered I gave Petra a torch. Probably should use it. There we go. Okay, there's one of the mages. Six. So now... Ah, oh, yes! Fernand does enough! Yeah. Nice! You should be honored. Well done, Ferdy. So now let's have Violet go ahead. Ugh, I don't like these odds at all. 
That's a little better, but can we get Lin... Nah, we can't. Linhart's way too far away. All right. Can I do anything cool here? Actually, wait. Do I have any... I swear I have an extra killing edge, which I could really give him right now. Do, 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 do. Killing edge, killing edge. I have the rape here. Yeah, we'll swap out a couple of Violet's weapons. For nicer ones. So let's go ahead and give him that. We can give him a Killer Lance. All right, let's see how well the Killer Lance does. You know what? I accept those odds. Dang it. No crit. That's not good. Ow. Probably shouldn't have accepted those odds, but oh well. Kill a Byleth. All safe there, so let's just have them wait for now. Caspar, let's have you inch up just a little bit. Okay. Catherine's turn is over, so now there's only eight more turns to go. This guy's going to attack Violet again. Are you serious? All right, at least the battalion leveled up a bit. I think it's maxed out now. Okay, Edelgard's gonna... <laughs> She's just gonna one-shot another soldier. Dang. Okay, more reinforcements. Cool, now I know where they are. All right, so I'm gonna have Byleth use an Iron Sword. I messed up. All right, we're re rewinding time for that one. Jeez, that was a mistake. Okay, attack. That. There we go. That is that. There we go. Well done, Byleth. Now we can have... Thank yep, heal him up. Now, Petra can possibly... Yeah! All right, Petra. Get him! Ow. Yes, you will, Petra. Not be stopping. It seems that taking out the priest has stopped the reinforcements coming over here. We should be able to stop the reinforcements coming from the other side by taking care of the other priest. That sounds good, oh, my lord. Okay. Hey, Dorothea. How about you just heal up Petra for now? Thank you. And now let's have Ferdinand go down here to assist her. And then have Edelgard just march down here. 10% <laughs> hit. Okay, Ash, get out of there. He's gonna get slaughtered. Poor guy. Let's get to Alright. Yoni. Ah, crud. Uh. What are the uh, You know what? Not bad at all. Dang, we might be able to wrap up this chapter in a moment. Sick. All right, and turn. All right, this is gonna hurt. Oh wait, uh, just a normal Pegasus Knight. Well done, Edelgard. <laughs> she is just annihilating everything in her path. Holy crud. Holy dump, that was a good level. Edelgard is a really good armor knight, jeez. States will suffer the punishment of the goddess! Terrible. Yeah, boy. This is gonna hurt. Unless it doesn't. There we go. It all comes down to this. This is not gonna hit. Nice. And here they all come. And on top of that, Petra doesn't have any ranged weapons on her right now. Gosh, I should have used this, the steel bow. Oh, well. Bro. Oh, that guy's moved entirely different. Oh, Lord, why? Lady Rhea, hold the line. Don't let them attack Lady Rhea again. I don't know. She seemed kind of capable to me. Anyway. <laughs> nice job, Ash. Everybody doesn't do too much damage, but... Okay. You shall not be forgiven. Well done, Rhea. Jeez. She can pack up all that bark anyway. Ah. Uh, this is what I get for not utilizing Ash that well. Jeez. Okay. So I guess. Alright. Catherine can't reach. As you wish. Hubert can, though. Ah, uh, but I want to kind of give Ash a kill, you know? No, there's no way I can pull it off. I'll at least. I'll at least put in some chip damage. One. Okay. Nicely done, Ash. Well played. You know what? We'll leave that to Ash for now. That's a good way for him to finally try and level um, 
can get his not only his class maxed out, but level up as well. Now you know your limit. And then Aelgar just completely one-shots this guy. Good lord. They will not be able to send any more troops now. Let us sweep up the stragglers. Good work, Lady Rhea. Let's round him up and cut him down. Not gonna lie, I kind of face palmed at that because we've all been doing the work, and yet that's Catherine's reaction. Jeez. The Don't get me wrong, I'm okay with Catherine. It's just, good lord, she is. Wait. Duh, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> anyway. Well done, Petra. Okay, so now we can have Linhart go ahead and heal up Petra. And now we gotta remember that there is one more straggler over here somewhere. Be careful about that. And then we... I don't know if Leone can just end off the level right now. I don't know. I'm just gonna have her back off for a moment. Ah, dang it. I knew that would happen. Okay, we'll focus on that later. Now, though, let's just end our turn. Okay, yep, just as I thought. This guy's going... Okay, nicely done, Dorothea. Nicely done. Now that's gonna... Missed entirely. Good. Alright. You got this, Ash. If not, Byleth's gonna kill him anyway, because apparently Byleth is weaker? What? Okay. Hey, uh, let's try Iron Axe to see. He can use Helm Splitter, but yeah, let's just stick with the bow for now. One, two. Alright, that's nice. So now let's move Edelgard down here because she has been a just a walking tank here. Holy crud, she's just insane for this chapter. Okay, now he's targeting Ash again, which means this guy's in Helm Splitter range for death. Good. Alright, so now let's go have Ash finally use Helm Splitter. Pray it hits! Yes! I must steal myself. Oh, he didn't level up. Come on. Oh well, let's end this level off. So let's move Aelgard over here. Hey Leone, how much do you do? Yep, that'll do it. One. <laughs> Not gonna lie, she didn't do much this whole level, but hey, might as well give her the final blow. <laughs> Ayo! Apostates, you sully the name of the goddess. You are the apostates. The goddess is with me. Okay, so are there any more enemies around here? Or are we just finished? Because I swear that's the last of them. We'll see. If not, this will just be a good excuse to give um, Edelgard and Lin... Not Edelgard, sorry. Linhart and Dorothea more EXP by healing up everyone. And by doing other stuff. Hey! Let's see if now has dark spikes. Sick. Alright, so I'm just gonna try and move everyone back and just fast forward through the rest of this stuff because there's not much left that we can even do. <laughs> Alright, so time to just try and grind out these last few turns while I can because holy crud, there's not much to do right now. There was literally nothing I can do aside from just heal up, I guess. But is there anyone I can heal up at all? I guess. Dance. Yet. There we go. I can try and move Leone back here, though, or she'll be in physic range. <sighs> it's just gonna be one of those things, I guess. Not gonna lie, though, Edelgard is doing really well now. It's actually insane. Right, Caspar back. Did anyone really get injured that I haven't healed up yet? Wow, I've already patched literally everyone up. I guess I should just try and... Yeah, I guess I just need to just continue things and uh, just dance... Have Dorothea dance for a little bit while these last few turns run by. So, uh, be right back, I guess. Back to the fray. Thank you. Goddess, have mercy. There we go. Forgive them their sins and save their souls. It would have been better if we'd captured the bishop, but they didn't make it easy for us. What now, Lady Rhea? 
We must go to the headquarters of the Western Church. Perhaps there is still someone there who knows what has transpired. Let us help too. It may not be much, but we'll do whatever we can. I am sure you will be a great help. I am glad to have you by my side. We protected Rhea. Jews of the Wind. Hmm. All right, these increase movement by one. Good. And a critical ring, which increases critical rates. High five, which is fine, but still. And Umbral Steel. And the MVP, I swear if it's not who I think it is, it's gonna be weird. There we go. There was no way she was not getting MVP. She did so good in this level. And we got the Gaspar Knights. That's it. Thanks, Professor. I really appreciated your help with the investigation. That's it for today. Head back to Garrig Mach. The church will have to choose a new bishop and do whatever else is necessary to rebuild the Western Church. Lady Rhea is grateful to all of you. She said she would send along a reward. You should feel very proud. Receiving a gift directly from Lady Rhea is exceedingly rare. Still, that was a real mess, huh? For them to come out and charge us so boldly. I'm glad we made it out. As am I. We kept Lady Rhea safe, thanks to you. Hey, where did Ash go? I haven't seen him for a while. He couldn't still be back there, could he? That may be it. I hope he's not getting in the way. There he is. There you are, Ash. We were just talking about... Oh, boy. Why the brooding expression? Hey, what's that bundle of papers in your hand? This was given to me. It has to do with my family. Given to you? I haven't finished reading it all yet. But I think it might offer some clues about something I need to know. Professor, Catherine, thank you for letting me come with you on this mission. I'd better get ready to go. It's a little painful to watch. I do hope that those papers, whatever they are, will help him get over his past. I suppose it's time for us to start heading back to the monastery. And with that, everyone, that's going to wrap up this episode of Fire Emblem Three Houses. In the next episode, we're going to do another paralogue. So, thank you all so much for watching. Have a good day, guys. Bye!